Hello everyone, it's Ario, aka Yuno, aka the third fist guy. And um, I've been shit talking uh, Tri Brigade Zodiac a lot on the Master Duo meta. But um, after seeing uh, X last uh, idea on the deck, uh, I was. Uh, I was like, yeah, yeah, but, um, that changes things a bit. Like, uh, yeah, every, sh every build I see on Master Duo meta is shit in my opinion. <laughs> but um, I feel like um, I've got a list that's uh, at least on par somewhat uh, with the small bird. Maybe not as good, but um, kind of kind of on the same, on a similar level, on a similar tier. Um, but yeah, let's get started. I'm gonna do this uh, the profile. Of where I'm gonna build it all uh, from 0 to 1, so that uh, you have to at least skip to the end to see everything and can't just uh, click uh, and uh, leave and give me no view time. <laughs> so uh, yeah, uh, standard Trebegate Ratio, uh, max uh, Fractal to get removed to Grass, one Revolt. Uh, um, Revolt, uh, the second Revolt and uh, Infinite uh, and Imperial Order are um, okay. So I'm very biased against uh, any going first only cards uh, in a mid range deck, especially Tri Brigades. So I think uh, Revolt and uh, Imperial Order are uh, pretty shit uh, in this deck uh, because, like, uh, I already win most of the time. I'm going second. Uh, I would rather win uh, more going second. I, I'm already winning most of them going first. I would rather win more going second than uh, uh, win more going first because, like, I, I already have an easy time, and like, I do have an imperial order. I'm not coping. <laughs> um, but yeah. Next uh, for the zodiacs, we have. Uh, some people play one Catarust, one Remrom, but uh, for a similar principle, I want two Catarust uh, because uh, Catarust is the best one to draw when going second, while um, Remrom is uh, slightly better to search off tanky going first, basically, or to draw going first. Speaking of people tanky, and uh, I'm also playing the one from Shurio. Because I am not uh, actually playing uh, Rescue Cat. Um, the thing with Rescue Cat uh, is it's uh, way too fucking frail. Like, um, if you resolve Rescue Cat, uh, you are going to win, most likely. If uh, it gets stopped, uh, you are going to lose 100%. And uh, that's not a risk, uh, a risk I'm willing to take uh, in uh, this kind of deck. And uh, I also want uh, space for something that uh, I will show you soon. Uh, but yeah, um, finally for the kind of core cards, uh, monsters stuff, uh, we got the uh, double fusion destiny and uh, one celestial and one dasher, obviously. And uh, next uh, we are going into the most interesting uh, part of uh, the deck. Um, I'm gonna go into my favorite tabs. Uh, we have uh, two Nibirus, uh, three Ash Blossom, three Maxi, triple Effect Veiler. This is the big thing that I took uh, from Max Last. And we also have uh, a Cold Buy, uh, triple Droplet, and triple Imperm. Uh, basically, the idea behind this deck is um, Zodiacs uh, suck. Uh, going second uh, against uh, DPE or against um, the full uh, um, Swordsful board, which is what you see a lot of the time going uh, second, which is why I don't like uh, Zodiac Tragedy. But with Vader, you can stop Verte, you can stop uh, Baron, uh, well not Baron, the um, Jixiao, you can stop uh, the Moi. Two before that, which is better. Like you can, uh, you can mitigate their board where uh, a zodiac normal summon is good enough to use the board up 
or at least uh, they told their negates, basically. That's the idea behind the uh, Triple Valor. Um, yeah. Then for the extra deck, uh, very standard. Uh, you know, the Trabigate Zodiac uh, extra deck is uh, 16 cards, uh, so just, uh, you know. Verte, DP, Double Shurig, uh, Berbram, Morphergia, Parlogo, which is uh, one of the three main cuts. Uh, then we have um, uh, Zodiac, so one Dryden, Borbo, and uh, one uh, Chakanine. We have uh, our uh, Zeus, obviously. Access Scrub, Almirage. Double Dragon Lords, and for the last lot, I decided to go with uh, Hans Belger instead of uh, Palooza. If you were playing in a tournament uh, with uh, side deck and uh, best of three, basically, uh, I would uh, play a Palooza over Hans uh, Belger, or uh, maybe even over uh, Rugal, because uh, going first, uh, if you can end on uh, Rugal Revolt, you can also end on DP. Like Earth ADP instead of um, that, so like Rugal is still cutable, but uh, I don't feel like uh, if you're always going for Verte, you need to close uh, all that much, basically. <clears throat> so, yeah. Um, this is um, the best to try to get Zodiac deck profile of all time, baby! Let's go! And um, yeah, this is kind of like the only way I'm, I'm gonna feel comfortable with uh, Zodiac Tribrigate if we go full control, like boss to, boss to the wall, basically. Uh, 41st card of the, the deck would be Diddy Crow. I can't cut anything really. So yeah, if you like, if you don't have foolish burial, play Diddy Crow instead. Uh, so yeah, that's uh, that's all, folks. Um, subscribe, uh, leave a like, uh, join, the bell, join the Discord, uh, click the bell, uh, leave a comment, uh, all the good shit, uh, and uh, bye bye.